from Columbus, or Powell or Columbus? Columbus. From Columbus, Ohio, Jack Roslovic, welcome home. So Jack, for you is 2015, and uh, you didn't have to wait as, as long as these two or me or Jody, obviously, but. I'm still waiting. <laughs> you're still waiting. <laughs> <laughs> Tell us a little bit about the preparation before the draft and that whole day. How did it fold out? Uh, it was pretty amazing. I mean, we had a nice house in the South Beach that we rented, and it was uh, it was a day of family and friends. I think we uh, we took a fishing charter out, and I have told the story before. Uh, I got very sick, and went back to the house, recouped a little bit, got my suit on, we'll head over to the rink, and you know it was just a great family event, and we had a we had a good time. And like you said, I had to wait a little bit, but not too long. Jody, you hear that? When so you you're a high prospect. First round, you get a house in South Beach, go yeah. charter, and then when you're a, not a prospect but a suspect like Jody and I, <laughs> you're staying at the Motel 8, right, and watching it on TV. That's, That's how right. it works, right? Or you're outside <laughs> doing chores or something else, I guess. But uh, I have a question for all three of you guys quickly. Just, um, you know, it, it, you get drafted, and like Oliver said, it's the start of the journey. But when you look back now, uh, there's a lot that goes into it from draft day until the time you play your first National Hockey League game. What advice would you give a young Cam Atkinson, Oliver Bjorkstrand, and Jack Roselvik looking at this right now? I would say, you know, I, I always, my claim to fame is I went third overall in the sixth round. Um, you know, I knew that I was going to Boston College. You know, hockey, you never know if it's going to work out or not, but, uh, you know, just follow your dreams and, and don't let anyone tell you what you can and cannot do. And, if you want something bad enough, go out there and get it, no matter if you're a first-round draft pick like this little prima donna Jack Rosnick over here, <laughs> or a six-round pick like me. But um, like I said, if you want it and you're determined, you can do it. Oliver? Yeah, just, uh, I don't know, for myself, I feel like uh, uh, during the day I was a little disappointed that I dropped in the draft. Um, but as the years go on, you just realize that it's just the beginning and, um, you know, you just got to keep working and you're going to pass other guys that got drafted higher than you. So. Um, yeah, just keep working. All right, Jack, we're going to finish this up with you. A little advice for the little Jack Rosselvicks out at the Dublin and, and oh. Easton and out of Chiller North. Yeah, just keep on doing what you're doing. I mean, work hard every day, have fun, and, uh, you know, don't, don't be uh, too worried and wrapped up about what's going on. Just, you know, be in your own world and uh, really work hard. All right, Jack Rosselvick, Oliver Bjorkstrand, Cam Atkinson, thanks for your time. How about a round of applause for these guys appearing here tonight?